just a layup, this a rebound, then it's right, man. Tyson with the fade, not the air, my hands rocking. I'm with ball playing, no, it's not, 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 not. Okay. I'm not the same. Think of money, made me change, nothing else to blame. Bougie stuck up in my way, singing Gucci Gang. Gucci, Gucci, Gucci Gang, think I'm Gucci Mane. I'm just playing in the cut, I got my vans on. I'm not selfish, I get on the point. Check, check, one, two, one, two. This a layup, this yeah. a rebound, then it's right, man. Tyson with the fade, not the air, my hands rocking. When I link with ball point, you know it's not, not. What is going on, beautiful people? Welcome back. It's your boy Blue. We're back on Euro Truck Simulator 2. And I'm here with my uh, good friends, Graham and Raven. I think Raven's having some microphone issues, so he'll be here with us hopefully later on throughout our trip through Iceland. I am driving the Mercedes. I honestly don't know exactly the brand of this truck. I just know it's Mercedes, and I like it. New paint job. Oh yeah, we're riding through. We're gonna be doing some heavy lifting, um, and then some regular stuff, but it's gonna be some ice, some snow, some dirt, some tunnels, some... It's gonna be various uh, challenges ahead of us today. Um, and I'm still pretty novice of a driver. We got our, uh, our swerve partner, Graham, here. Also, a rookie. <laughs> so hopefully... Uh, things will go okay. We don't crash, don't wreck for Blue Arrow logistics, logistics today. So let's hop into Euro Truck Sim and hope to God that it doesn't crash. We are on the Pro Mod server. This is Pro Mod 2.45, just released late last week. And what else? What's not forgetting? Uh, my, my, my. Yeah, I think that's it. Oh, and we're truckers. We're on truckers and P. We're on multiplayer. I'm gonna hop in the truck. Track IR is working. I got it on my headband. Or on my my uh thingy. Hold on, I gotta tab one more time. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Okay, Graham, can you hear me? Uh, yeah. Alright, beautiful. Alright, we're gonna roll off and just hope, you know, because every every time, every stream it crashes at least once for us. Um you don't know when it's coming, but it's gonna happen. <laughs> what up Andy? Good to see you, man. Jay knows the way welcome to the stream. Andrew Cunningson. Thank you guys for coming through. Hope you guys are having a good week. Uh, things did not go so uh, as planned last week for me. I wanted to do a few more streams, get some X playing in, get some other stuff going on, but uh, life got in the way. Between um, my computer giving me problems and. Uh, uh, wait, am I moving? Yeah, between my computer giving me problems and uh, a really crazy busy work week last week. Oh, very hard for me to to get anything through. All right, we're gonna be we're over here. I'm gonna show you guys where we're at. Again, we're on Promos 2.45. This part of the map is not new. It's been here on been here on the Promos part. But if you're if you don't have Promos, you would not be able to get to Iceland. Um, but last time, our last drive was over in the Middle East, which you'll see if you did watch that video. You'll see that it's actually been expanded in a 2.45 update. It now includes Iraq. Um, I think part of Saudi Arabia, uh, a few more roads out here. I think it's an, one extra road through Israel or Egypt, one of those. Um, so some more stuff. They've added quite a bit. They've added the Roads of the Black Sea DLC, which I honestly have no idea where that DLC is. I haven't even driven in that yet, but that uh, has been added to ProMods 2.45. But we're in Iceland today because I want to drive through some icy conditions and some snow. I haven't got. To, I, I wasn't here during the winter time. I didn't do it then. So yeah. All right. So we're over here in this place. I'm not gonna try to to pronounce it and thank you whoever that was i'm gonna see it here pop up on my on my my screen here in a little bit but uh, i think that was a host so thank you for the host i really do appreciate that very very much so we're looking for a job um our first job will be from from here to here i, I don't know the name of the places just from the north of north of iceland to basically like the southern southwestern vest vestman uh, we're supposed to have like a digger or some kind of thing um, it said it was at a quarry. I don't know where the quarry is. No idea where that is. But we gotta find our job. We do have a job that we should have ready. Hopefully it's in here. It would suck if it wasn't. Let's see if I can find it. The way around. 
Oh god, please tell me that it's here. Please tell me it's here. Uh oh. Uh oh, it might not be here, guys. Uh... So, um... <laughs> For the job creation thing to work, do I have to create it on multiplayer? And I'm pretty sure it can just work. So I did it. I do it. Did it in single player, and it's supposed to be. Is it an external contract? Is that what it, where it would be? I don't think so. Right. It would be great market. Great market. Right. All right. Fourth page, bottom one. Okay. Let's see. Three, four, four pages. I don't see it, my man. Let's uh, let's load back up. I'm gonna do a a, a quick save or a load of my quick save, and maybe that'll get it get it done for me. Let's see what happens there. Hopefully, it works. It might crash. Who knows? Worst case scenario, I might have to regenerate the job. Um, I had a very specific route I wanted to take today, so we'll see what happens. All right, cool. So we're here, I think, in the same location. And let's see if it is working now. I go to the job market, rate market. And of course, now my truck is in freaking Amsterdam. That's probably why it reset. Let's see if I click on this over here, if it's gonna be here. <laughs> uh, la, 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 la. And are you serious? It's not here? All this preparation and the job that I actually want is not even here. That is ridiculous, guys. Wow. Yeah, the one I was looking for. I had a job going directly to where I wanted it to go. So I might have to make it again, and you guys might have to stand by it because I'm doing this job. I'm not doing another job. I guess I could do this one. This is not bad, but that's like plan B. Yeah, that's plan B. So I guess something messed up my quick save. So I have to do it again. I did Raven. I loaded up quick save just now. And I guess, yeah, because I created it in single player. And maybe it expired because, you know, the time between single player and multiplayer is very different. So I'm thinking maybe it expired. So uh, Kings, yeah, we usually do like small convoy drive, like three, four of us. Um, so... Yeah, I'm gonna do that, guys. So stand by. I'm gonna turn some music on, and because I really want to do this drive, it looked like it's pretty interesting. Um, Euro trucks in my crash. I don't know, but also, who cares? So I'm just gonna turn some music on, and we're gonna get that job back up and going. Cause I want to go from here to here, or over here, and in there, and in there. So I'll make it happen. I'm gonna do it as quick as I can. Oh, this is not even the right truck either. <laughs> Where's my other truck? Hold on, truck manager. I'm wondering if that truck even doesn't exist. Like, have I did I override it? What the heck? This is crazy. Yeah, that truck is gone. Hold on, I'm gonna go to my other save. My, I guess my auto save. Oh my god, that's hilarious. All right, I'm gonna go to my auto save. Which uh, is none of these show auto saves. There we go. I'll stay Wednesday. Yeah, load that. We'll see what that is. I know, right? Everything goes wrong with us in ATS. I had everything planned, but you know, it is what it is. We're just gonna enjoy it. We're gonna get as far as we can today, and we're gonna enjoy it. We're not gonna stress about it. Uh, this is my quick, my auto save, which I don't know when that was. And my truck that I created before we started the stream, I think is gone. It, it's like it never existed. It should have been in Iceland, but it is not. All right, well, two things we gotta do now. We gotta create a truck, create a job. So I'm gonna do the truck. Um, let's go ahead and do truck manager. I want that truck. It's very, it's like, it's the same truck, just different, small, just different things. Uh, truck dealer. You know what's funny too is I loaded up the beginning of the stream with the truck. And now when I did my quick save, the truck is gone. Oh well. Uh, see, truck dealers, it's Mercedes is what I had because I just like that truck right now. That is so weird, man. Buy online. 
uh, while I'm buying things online. Uh, I guess I guess should do the truck first and then. I think it's this one, the Giga. Yeah, get the Mercedes Giga customized. Um, I had that. That was the same. I think I changed it to this one, the V125. I changed the engine to the uh, 16 speed. I think is what I had did. Um, yeah, the 16 speed was better for uneven terrain and hills and maneuvering. So I did that because our trip is gonna be pretty uh, trippy. Uh, and then we can go to the red. I had a red paint job. I like this one. It's like the same as a gray, except it's red. <laughs> uh, and then we'll go over here. Uh, accessories. I didn't really. I don't really go too crazy on accessories. I gave us some different tires. I took the elemental, hoping it'd be better on the snow. I could be wrong, but that's kind of what my mindset was when I picked these. So it's still a D. It's the same as a Trailmaster. It's better on fuel though, and it's a little bit quieter. Just a tiny bit quieter. Uh, what else did I have on the truck? I had a thing up top for uh. Yeah, for the beacon. I think we'll take this the flat one. And then I don't think I had anything here. No, I didn't have anything here. I did put a uh, a cool little strobe pattern here, which I kind of like. I don't. I kind of like to keep the truck simple. Sometimes less is more. We we'll put a few LED strobes here, right next to the Mercedes symbol. I think that's real classy looking. Not too much. Not too little. So we'll put that there. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? I think that's it. Honestly, like I really didn't customize too much. I think I just spent a lot of time looking at it <laughs> whenever I made it. So we'll leave it at that. I'm cool with that. I'm I'm cool with that. Let's move on to the interior, uh, which I did nothing. I don't think I did anything with the interior. Uh, hold on. Turn. Turn. Yeah. I'm cool with that. Uh, we'll go ahead and confirm now. It's changed to me $306,000 for that. We'll purchase it and we'll send it over to where we want to be driving today. Ooh. Uh, I can't move the map. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Right click to move. So we over here at Accu Accuray. And I'm going to send it there. We'll hit OK. Alright, money sent. Purchase has been made. We'll close that down. And now I want to go to my garage manager and I want to teleport over there. So we'll click on that and we'll hit travel garage slot. Uh, actually, let me see. If I just go to truck manager and I go to that truck, I should be able to like just drive that truck. Drive it. Yes, I'm gonna drive it. So I think that's gonna send me over there. What's up, Nathan? Good to see you, man. Welcome to the stream. Uh, we're about to hop on Pro Mods, man, and do some driving around Iceland. Had a little bit of a hiccup. Actually, we're still in Amsterdam. Uh, had a little bit of a hiccup where everything that I had ready for today's stream reset itself. So we're trying to reset it again or get it set up again for today's drive. So we'll travel over here to Poland. No, sorry, Iceland. Thank you, Andrew. Cool. Good to know. Quality mapping beyond borders and beyond limits. Five years. Wow. I didn't, I didn't know Promos has been around for five years. I just found out about it. Found out about it like five weeks ago. All right. So we're still online, though. We've been doing all this stuff online. Let's get the truck started. Oop, not that wrong button. Uh, here we go. I'm just gonna pull around the back, and um, I'm going to. Oh, please don't tell me we're in Amsterdam. Okay, no, we're not in Amsterdam. We can see snow way out in the distance. I'm gonna pull around to the side, and then I'm gonna get the job set up for us. And actually, I'm gonna move. You guys said you were at the gas station? Where is the gas station? I've um, um, gone to the car. Oh, I see you right there. I wish to find somewhere to pull over. While well, I can set these jobs up. Uh. Is there like a shop or something out here somewhere? I just don't like sitting around the garage where everybody has their freaking reversers on. It's so annoying. <laughs> I was gonna pull over over here. Alright, 
right, cool. Parking brake is on, engine going off. And uh, I'm gonna go get those shots. Actually, I need to do, uh, I think, what, quick save first, right? I feel like something's missing in my truck, but oh well. All right, let me go find this thing. That's so disappointing. We should be on the road already. Shouldn't be creating jobs. It is what it is. Hopefully it shouldn't take too long. I kind of know what I made. Nathan, you on vet sim, man? Dope, bro. Yeah, we gotta do some flying soon, for sure. Um, I'm not planning on playing X-Plane or, or streaming X-Plane until Friday this week. Um, tomorrow, which is, yeah, tomorrow I plan on going uh, on DCS World and uh, having some fun with the new Super Carrier DLC that's coming out tomorrow. Super hype about that. Alright, this man's where we're going. And pick up from the quarry. Drop it in the port. And I know I want to find the digger. I don't know where the quarry do you you know where the quarry is, guys, out here? No? If my job is to pick up at the quarry, I just don't know where the quarry is. That might be why I couldn't find it. Alright, first job is created. Alright, second leg. Man, it sucks. I'm also gonna get a digger just in case I can't find it. Oh, shoot. No! Okay, cool. <laughs> I hit the wrong button. Alright, cool. Seconds. I think this belongs something. I think a second job I had was like, uh, the second job was supposed to be like petrol. Yeah, I had petrol for the second job, so it's not heavy. First one's supposed to be a heavy job, second one's gonna be kind of like a regular. Uh, just transporting some petrol from one place to another. I said that I love you when you ain't say that shit back. It's kind of hard to just trust you when both your feelings don't match. Got me so less emotions. I don't want to get There it is. Once I give you my word, I swear it ain't no going back. And then if we have time, we'll do the third. Is the, the first and second legs are a bit longer than we anticipated. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and open up the map so I can find where we're going. So first leg, we'll be starting off here at... Uh, uh, Aki, whatever, and we'll be driving through this center section of Iceland over here to Vestman. And it's a small little ferry at the end. And from there, from Vestman, we'll be heading back to the very, very top of the long Arvik. <laughs> and then from there, um, we would like to go from there all the way to Ray something. I think it's called Radar. Um, but we're probably not going to be able to complete that leg, so we might just do the first two. But I'm going to go ahead and plan it just in case uh, we can actually make it. Um, we're already behind now because stuff wasn't working, but you know, you never know. It might go a little bit faster than we thought. Probably do some easy parkings so that we can get some more driving in. What's the name of that place? Ray Radar? Radar, 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 Radar. Where is it at? There it is. All right, cool company. I'll take a sand skip. Now, I'm using the virtual speditor. I didn't mention that, but I'm using the virtual speditor to create a specific jobs for specific places with specific things. Um, just to kind of make it easier for all of us to have the same or similar jobs. I don't remember what I have for the last leg. I'm just gonna put like some. Uh, oh, I had uh, forklifts. That's what I was doing. Forklifts. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Where's the forklift? There's. All right. And add cargo. Most of my friends Save. don't went through it and they still talk. See, they gonna try and tell you what they think is good for you. 
whole time they was plotting, man, I wish they was for you. Uh, Andy, it says explore. That means I've only explored 5.10% of the entire map, which is actually pretty sad. Because <laughs> um, a lot of people have probably, you know, done a lot more. So that's kind of like a goal. So you see where you see, like, the yellow in the roads? That's showing the parts of the map that I have driven and explored. So all the, the names in yellow are places that I've been. These are routes that I've driven um, since I've had Euro Truck Simulator. Now, some other people may have all of it discovered. You can see I haven't spent much time in the UK. Haven't spent much time um, down here, um, down in Italy right now. But, you know, working on it. I have a new profile. So, anyways, we're ready to go, guys. I need you to get back out here. Uh, let's get out of the world map. And then, uh, who's that in the road? <laughs> I'm gonna go to my quick save, and hopefully this will work. So let's see what happens. What up, Infinite Aviation? Good to see me. Welcome to the stream, bro. Glad to have you aboard, man. You're thinking about getting ETS2 Gold. What is that? Is it like a big package where you get everything? Uh, Alright, please don't crash. It might crash. It hasn't crashed yet, so it might. Right now, I'm getting the spinning wheel of death. Alright, well, so Graham, how you doing, man? <laughs> ah, Can you guys, uh, let's get a mic check for you real quick. Can you, you guys hear, uh, Graham? I don't think Raven's talking. If he is, you can speak now. But, um, hopefully we can hear Graham okay. But yeah, so how you doing, man? How are you living? What's, what's going on over there on your side of the world? And nothing much. You on lockdown? Music is loud. I can turn it down. Alright, that should be a lot lower. And I'll get sure he's a bit higher. What time is it over there for you? Five bucks, five. Gotcha. Yeah, Euro Truck is about to trip out. <laughs> uh, it's like not responding. It's probably gonna crash. You do speak a little quiet, but that's okay. I just turned you up. Coastal Aviation, man. What's up, man? Good to see you. Welcome to the stream. I understand how it is because, like, there's times when I can't talk or I don't want to talk or I can't talk loud. And now you hear me I'm like, yeah, you know, so it is what it is. Uh, Jay knows way. Can you be my GPS? Maybe? I don't know. Do you know your way around? <laughs> Depends. What are the disadvantages of Euro Truck Simulator 2? Hmm. That's a good question. It seems like the more mods you get, you add the ETS, the worse it gets. And what way do you mean, Nathan? Like, and I think this thing is crashing. I think I'm going to have to, like, force quit it because it's taking too long to respond. Yeah, I'm gonna. Uh, well, I'm gonna have to force crash it. Didn't even crash yet. I'm, I'm gonna have to force crash it because it's tripping. Yep, there we go. Close program. Well, we wanted that to happen anyways. Alright, so let's go walk, try that again. Hopefully, when I load it up, it will have my quick save that I can get my jobs from. So that's what I'm hoping for. Uh, yeah, Nathan, that is true. You do get more crashes with more mods. So I, I do. I do agree to that for sure. Uh, I usually only get one per session. Like right now we're trying to play, I'm gonna get one crash and after that it should be okay for the rest of the time. Um, uh, that's really all I get. I don't really get multiple crashes all that much. Sorry for music, guys. <laughs> yeah, the session's not loading. Yeah, every every blue game stream has like, errors. For sure. I mean, last week I, t I was I, I tweet not tweet I think I, I did tweet I tweeted that I was so frustrated with X Plane, <laughs> um, and people were asking me why I didn't respond because I was busy with other things, but. Uh, I was so frustrated last week when I was trying to, I think it was either Wednesday or Thursday or Friday. I don't know what day it was, but I was so sick of X playing. Um, and it really wasn't anything specific. It was just like 
how much I go through to make one X Plane stream happen, it, it just gets annoying. Um, and I basically rage quit <laughs> X Plane last week uh, because I was like, man, what the heck? Why do things just not work? Like, why can't I just turn X Plane on and, and my plane just work, right? Or or this thing that I'm trying to do just work. Um, it just is so annoying. Coastal Aviation, I'll see you next time, man. Thank you very much, my man. Thank you very much. Yes, Pro Mods is free, but you uh, the only paid part about it is if you want to get a faster download. Um, it's not, I don't know how slow it is because I haven't done a free one, <laughs> but I just know that I was like, you know what, I, I don't want to wait. So, yeah, crazy stuff. Come on, come on, Pro Mods, you got me, man. Let's do it. But uh, I guess we could talk a little bit as we're waiting for last week. I had my X plane issues. Um, that was really the only th other thing I was planning on playing. I was thinking about doing some racing. That didn't work out either um, because of Easter um, and my job being related to the church and everything. Like it was super busy um, getting stuff ready online for them uh, like all week long. So it was really busy, which is good for me that I'm actually busy and I actually have work. So I'm thankful for that for sure. Um, but it was really busy all the way up to like Saturday and then yesterday as well um mondays are always busy for me as well i don't stream on mondays but i did have uh, a lot more work because of easter on monday um and then today finally kind of like my first day to kind of like take a, a slight breather i do have to go right right back to work after today's stream which is the reason why when streams like go off schedule or take longer than usual or uh or delayed um it kind of really messes up my day and the flow of my day because i i usually have to go right straight to work right after i stream so if the stream goes long i'm late with what i need to do with work as well um this is as well if it's, if it's delayed what up high champion good to see you man yeah nathan uh back on the x plane subject uh as i'm still waiting okay there we go jeez pro mods what are you doing my man like ay, ay, ay. making me look bad right now i was trying to promote you and now you're just looking bad um another load screen <laughs> Load screen simulator. Remember how I mentioned I was gonna play a bunch of simulators? Here we go. Load screen simulator, which is actually a thing. Look it up on Steam. There's a load screen simulator. I have a list now. Uh, but Vulcan, let's see if this stuff is working. Uh, Vulcan, uh, I tried again over the weekend. I was so fed up with it last week. I uninstalled it and I was just playing with a regular X plane. But this past weekend, I was like, you know what? Let me try it out. Now that I'm, it's the weekend, I usually don't stream on the weekend. Let me see if I can get some stuff in, in you know, in order. Let's see if I can get it working. And I got Vulcan working. And I did some other stuff to kind of uh, beef up my computer. Not really beef it up, but kind of better optimize my computer. And now I'm finally seeing really good frames. Um, 60 frames, 70, 80, uh, depending on where, where I'm at. Like if I'm at in LA uh, or London, I'm getting like right at 30, which is way better than what I was getting before. Before I was getting like 19 and 22. So it's definitely helping. Look at this jackknife, Jesus. All right, let's see if we got these jobs. P please, please. If it doesn't, we're gonna go to plan B. Um, hopefully we'll, we'll plan A will work out though. So let's see what happens. Uh, let's see, we want to destination down. There she is, Vestmanjabinamur. <laughs> That's my job right there. All right, cool, I love it. Set GPS location, let's freaking go. Oh my God. How long did it take us guys? What was that 30 minutes just to get our first job in? All right. All right, Graham. You ready, ready man? Ready to roll. Is Raven still yeah. here? All right, cool. I don't All know right. where we're picking up this first job. All right, it's way over there. That's no problem. No problem, though. If you set a marker, if you set a marker in the middle of the map, it's quicker. Like, oh, but you're in the way, so I forget this is not a this isn't a collision zone. So when I try to go through you, <laughs> I can't. So I have a sound mod on my single player that I've been playing with, and now playing on multiplayer again where the sound mod is, you know, doesn't work. It's actually pretty fun. Did Raven crash? Oh, I think Raven crashed because he just re-logged into your truck simulator. Yeah, Ray, uh, there's still some issues with Vulcan. Oh, headlights. They're on, man. They're on. Chill out. Um, I... Yeah, Vulcan still has some issues with some stuff, but honestly, like, I... 
I know I talked not really bad about Vulcan last week. Yeah, I just wasn't extremely time. excited about Vulcan because I didn't have a great experience with it um, last week. But after this weekend, after finally getting some right. some focus testing on on Vulcan and things, um, it's been a bit better for me. So I'm, I'm I'm more excited about the future and what is possible. It still has bugs. It's still not really 100% working as it should. There's a lot of things that still don't work with it yet. Um, pretty much almost all my uh, like little plugins don't really work so much with it. Get ready but, to turn left. Um, like my X Enviro and things like that. But I like I'm I'm happy that I'm actually able because like before left. I had to turn my settings way down to get smooth frame just so I can stream. And honestly, like it looked okay. I mean, people liked the way it looked, but at the same time, I knew what I wanted it to look like. Um, and so now it's kind of like now I can finally. Uh, play at higher frames than I did before. Still not like amazingly high. It is definitely smoother and I really do notice the smoothness because whenever I'm making my X-Plane review videos and those cinematic cameras and things like that, uh, one of the things that always, always really bothered me was the stuttering. And I was like, there's no reason that my, like my computer is way too strong to be getting this stupid stuttering effect. Um, and now like I went kind of back to some of those same locations that I recorded some of those uh, videos some of the same planes And I was like, yeah, okay. It's definitely smoothing it out still has a tiny bit of stutter here and there But it's a lot better. There's also some other bugs like whenever you're flying pretty high up You know the textures are getting blurred out in the ground stuff like that. So hopefully they're gonna fix all those things We'll see what happens <laughs> Oh shoot, here's our turn Yeah, Jay knows why we need your voice for GPS, I guess. All right, so guys, again, we're in Iceland, so I've been pretty excited about driving out here ever since I heard about it. Uh, heard about the opportunity, the options of driving Iceland. Like, I, Iceland sounds so foreign to me. Um, and I thought Iceland was more of a green area, but there is, I think half of the island is, is green because I was driving last night on, uh, on here as well, and I was driving in like a, a more of a greenish, area wasn't snow at all so I was like hey guys like where the heck is all the snow at I know there's snow but where is it because it ain't here but I was on the other side of Iceland so we'll probably go be going through both today as we try to get back on schedule to pick up our first drop I believe it should be at some type of quarry or something like that but it's pretty dope lake look at that scenery and as always look at the time <laughs> it's late so the sun's going down but we shouldn't have too much of a night time here. But yeah, the Mercedes has become my current favorite. It might change. I might go back to the Scanny later on or something else. But right now, I'm really digging the Mercedes. There's a lot of people out here, I have to say. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too, Andrew. That's what I was always taught. <clears throat> that Iceland is the green one, and Greenland is the ice one. But I think they both do get snow. But I guess the part of Iceland we're at right now is actually icy. <laughs> so we should have some pretty fun icy uh, or icy roads, some, some dirt roads I think we're going to have planned in today, and uh, some very windy roads, which is my type of driving. If I was in real life, I would prob probably be scared for my life driving through the roads we'll be taking today get ready to turn left i'm doing my best our first job should be kind of heavy i don't know if this turn is going to be the one we'll see what happens uh andy i'm using the thrustmaster t150 wheel it's a pretty simple wheel it's one of the, the 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 cheaper wheels that you can get but it does have force feedback and that's what i wanted Oh man, is this... I think I actually do feel a traction difference. Oh man. Yeah, I think I'm actually feeling a traction. Let me see, I'm gonna try slamming on the brakes. We don't have a trailer so we can actually do this. Nope, okay, it's not working. Never mind. If, if it was icy, we would actually like start sliding down. We're going downhill too, so I think it's okay. I don't think there's actually any ice out here. But cool, because I personally have never seen snow on any of the truck simulators. I've been watching Ice Road Trucking, and that show has been crazy interesting to me. 
Alex, Yuki, what's up, man? Good to see you. Welcome to the stream, bro. Yeah, we're missing IFMG this week. He doesn't have the DLC to join us. Uh, one of the downsides to Pro Mods is that uh, you have to have all the DLC to use it. Now, you could use an older version of, of Pro Mods, but it, it, the multiplayer server has updated to this version of Pro Mods. And this is a long trip just to. Oh, okay. Now we got some dirt. This is interesting. It's a little bit of dirt. <laughs> like a dirt patch. Oh man, I feel like this, the truck is not turning. Thank you, Alex, for the follow. Welcome to the Blair Roy family. Is there a second one? Nope, okay, I can't see. <laughs> Gamer as well, thank you for the uh, follow. Welcome to the Blair Roy family. Sorry guys, I'm looking to the left, looking at my, at my other screens. I can't see my follows on this screen. Yeah, I think these roads might be a little, a little bit slippery. <laughs> Look at that. Man, I love windy roads like these. This is cool. I'll be careful today. All right, Graham, we got to be careful today. We don't want to die. Wi-Fi finally fixed. That's great, man. Happy for you, bro. Get ready to. Yeah, we're life. definitely not making that third leg. No, I think of. <laughs> definitely. Oh man! All right, we got a right turn at the hotel. And we're going uphill. That was just a journey, gang. Here. I know, right? That's crazy. That was just the journey to get to the pickup. We don't have a trailer yet. That's crazy, bro. Drive with caution, snow ahead. Oh, I've never gotten that notification. Okay. I don't really know how to drive in snow. I'm from Texas. <laughs> we don't have snow here. I feel like I need to go down and put some chains on the bottom. This is cool, though. This is really cool. Uh, my man Alex, we are in uh, <laughs> Iceland. I don't, whenever somebody asks me that, I forget where we're at. We're in Iceland. ACS, what's up, man? Freaking Texan driving on ice. Oh, our favorite song. It's not that bad. We're going 45 kilometers right now. I just want to stay in his groove, I assume. I only assume, like, I can only assume what to do on snow, but usually with you, your natural reaction to on snow is not always the right thing to do, so we'll take it slow. Look how wine, this is dope. Only thing I think I've ever done on snow is rally racing. <laughs> That's it. Uh, yes, Andrew. Actually, we did get snow, uncharacteristically, um, uh, last year, the year before last, something like that. Only certain parts, though. Like North Texas, will get snow from time to time, and we survived our first snow patch. And now we're on the dirt. Honestly. It's all over now. All right, here's our pickup. I guess this is, this is the quarry. Alright, man. This is gonna be interesting. It's gonna be challenging. Alright, so we have... Yeah, this one. The wheel loader. 15 tons. What else? Do we just, like, just out of curiosity. What else is coming out of here? Nothing else. Okay, cool. We'll take this. And uh, we'll take a job. Let's go get it. <laughs> Even Mexico got snow. Yeah, I'm not... I don't know, something's wrong with our world, because we're not supposed to be getting snow. It worries us when we get snow. The crazy thing out here in Texas is, like, when snow happens, like, the wor like the whole city shuts down. Hello, Starly. <laughs> Can you guys see the Steam notifications on top right, on top left? Just out of curiosity. Alright, uh, nice, Corey. Where's it at? Yeah, we just, like, we never get snow. I gotta find out how to get to where we're picking something up. I think it's this way. Alright, 
There's one job over there. That's not ours, though. I think you gotta keep going down. This is open. Oh, what did I hit? Oh, that's blocked off. I still wanna give me a shifter. I think that'd be cool. I think that would make trucking a whole lot more fun and interesting for me is to have a shifter and have to actually like float gears and stuff like that. I left my heart in Stockholm. Hey. Man, I'll be jamming this song, man. <laughs> yeah, Starly, I saw it. I just don't know if, you, if, if everybody can see it on top of it. <laughs> I'm learning piano, so songs like these that have like that are very heavy piano driven are really like dope to me right now. All right, mirrors on. This is gonna be interesting because uh, snow, all these wheels, weight, thirteen tons, a dozer. Who knows what else is ahead of us? Alright, out of reverse, park and brake on, and let's, let's go ahead go. and couple it up. Go home. Stockholm, Stockholm. Uh, Farnborn Media, will I be streaming Infinite Fight again? The answer is yes. When? I don't know. Probably not anytime soon. Um, I may. I may do a stream whenever the 777 releases on the next Infinite Fight update, but I don't see myself doing one anytime before then. And we don't know when that's going to be released, so. Alright, we got a job. Hopefully the uh, the new overlay I put on the top right is working. Uh, I just made that this morning. <laughs> Captain Socks, what's up man? Welcome to the stream. They saved this truck and handled a trip. Uh, so we'll be heading 14 hours, Jesus. Um, and actually, uh, guys, meet me at the exit, which I think you already are doing. But I want to kind of amend my uh, my route. I don't want to go through the coast. I want to take it straight down the middle. Play one of my songs, Party or Crazy. I would, but then that would de that would demonetize my whole drive because I do have that copyrighted. It's complicated. <laughs> what are my thoughts of FMOD coming to ETS2? To be honest with you, I'm surprised I didn't have it already. That are my th that's my thoughts. Um, for both American Truck Sim and Euro. Oh, we're stuck on the hill! Oh my god. Come on. This is too too soon. Too soon. There we go. <laughs> wow. We're gonna see a lot more of that today, guys. Trust me. Yes, I can play my own songs, my own stream. But the way that the copyright stuff works uh, with music is, uh, is weird. All right, let me lead the way, guys. I'll take the front. I'm gonna pull over to the right here in a second here, Raven. Okay, hold on, right here. All right, I wanna mi uh, mix up our drive. So you see how it has us going uh, like through Ray, Rayka, Reykjavik or whatever. I wanna go this way. So I'm gonna set a waypoint uh, like over here somewhere random. Yeah, so I'm gonna go that way. I have no idea what's in here, but it looks it looks sketchy. There's like snow roads, there's dirt roads, and then there's whatever this symbol is. So I don't know. Actually, I want. What is that symbol? Can we go that way? What, what is that symbol? Let's go that way. Oh, is that a tunnel? Might be a tunnel. Let's go that way instead. I'm gonna take this one off, and we'll go. So in case you guys need gas, I think there's a gas station. Oh, there's a rest stop right here. So we'll go through this rest stop. In case anything goes wrong, why? 
Okay, that's weird. Hold on. So it still wants to go this way, right? And then if I put a if I put a thing here, it goes this way and then it goes back around. Like, how stupid are you? I don't want to go that way. I'm trying to tell you now that I don't want to go that way. Okay, cool. So I put a second point there. It puts us in the direction I want to go. Yeah, I like that. Let's do that right there. So that's my new job. So it's just so you, uh, I, no, Raven and Graham. If you see my screen, that's where I'm putting my points. That's what's gonna take us. I don't want to go the other way. All right, let's go. Time to get the job done. Yes, it is. Oof, spinning them tires. <laughs> that is so dope. Oh my god. This is crazy. My drive by camera's not even working. <laughs> wow. We don't need fuel. Why would we need we don't need any fuel stops? Do we? You need fuel are you gonna need fuel ground? Uh no. Okay good. Yeah, so we're not planning on stopping for fuel. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh I think I was too high of a gear. Let's try that again. Hey, I'm I'm learning right now. I right, have the fifth, six, and here's seventh on the edge. Another night of driving on Truckers MP. Uh, Raven has an issue with his mic, that's why he's not talking. I like the snow, it just adds a, another challenge, you know? Because usually you're just driving, it's usually not that difficult <laughs> to drive. When driving, the main challenges are the elements of nature. Snow, rain. It's like flying. When it coast down, we're only at 36 kilometers. See? I think the drive up got us ready. What you guys go? You guys crash back there? You guys, you okay? I got a little stuff. Yeah, lost. There's only one way to go. I can hit stuff. Oh, Raven stopped. Ready Honestly, yeah, back. Graham is a pro keyboard driver. I could not do what he's doing right now with the keyboard. Oh, how did Raven get up here? How'd you get in front of me? <laughs> he must have moved when I was looking at the map. All right, guys, let's hit the road. I gotta get my shifting right. Oh, you got stuck. That's what you said. Are you still stuck or are you all right? You need a toe? It's gonna get harder than this. <laughs> it's supposed to get tougher than that. We just did. I think Raven's the only one who's actually been here. You to Oh, you really towed. Wow. All right, we're gonna have to count that. How many times are we gonna have to tow today? Each of us. I've gotten none. Hopefully, we won't have to tow anymore. Ice road trucking. What up, Christopher? Good to see you, man. Go to the stream, bro. Uh, Alex, I do not know where I will start next week. I kind of... I usually try to plan like a few days ahead. Or, ah, that's a lie. Like a day before. <laughs> I usually try to plan what we're going to drive, what we're going to do. I'm trying to get better at pre-planning all of my streams in general. Sometimes I do really well, and sometimes I don't. Usually, if we're doing like a tour, we'll plan like the whole thing like ahead of time. But if we're just doing some one-offs... You know, he'll, I'll be like, alright, tomorrow, let's do this. <laughs> or today, let's do this, or whatever. Sometimes it'll be last, last minute. You can hear my 
Thrustmaster T-150 vibrating from the, the rough road. Here's a little bit of uh, snow on the road. Sharp turn. Oh, wow. <laughs> you Like, sometimes it kind of surprises you. Like, at first you're like, oh, there's no physics here. Like, it's just vibrating. But then you hit, like, a little patch and then the wheel just goes. So it's kind of unpredictable. If you just join us, guys, we just picked up our job. Uh, picked up a dozer. Head into... Uh... I don't know. We're in Iceland, heading to Southern Iceland, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Lots of ice and snow ahead of us, so watch out. I'm all over the road right now, taking up all the road. Lots of windy turns. My kind of drive. Oh! Okay, I took that too fast. Look at the snow coming off. My wheels. Get ready to turn left. Wait, left? Yeah, left. Oh, you let me turn pass? Left. What are you doing, Raven? I think you let me pass. Alright, drive with caution. Snow ahead. Huh, good to know. Get ready to turn Not right. only is there snow, but we're also heavy. So yeah, there's that. Where's the road? That's the road? Turn right. Oh, this is gonna be it's just like a detour. Low bridge ahead. Oh god, that's what that meant. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Right, we are going uphill. And yeah, this is why we're not gonna make that last leg today. Uh, we're heavy and <laughs> look how slow I'm going. Daily life in Minnesota, really? Is this how it is in Minnesota? Good to know. I'm not going there. No, I actually, I actually like in real life I like snow. I don't like driving in it. But I like snow. Uh, I remember the very first time I ever saw snow in my lifetime was like, I think I was 18 or 19, and I was in Denver for like to visit for like a week or whatever, and it snowed, and I was so excited because my first time ever seeing snow. What up HD, you can see man. All right, we gotta watch out, there's a low bridge ahead, so I don't know how high our trailer is is it is it a rock bridge that's cool this is gonna be fun we might only make one trip. <laughs> let's see if we make it oh are you gonna make it raven if he doesn't make it i'm definitely not gonna oh my god look how tight this bridge is no freaking way oh my god look at this somebody come look at this Okay, it's not that low. It's just tight as egg. Oh shoot, I shouldn't have freaking looked. <laughs> Alright. What up, Jorge? Thank you, man. Definitely being careful in real life and in game. Trying to. You guys do the same. Wow, I, that. Can you imagine somebody coming from the opposite direction? <laughs> Alright, back on the snow. That was cool. That was really cool. Now we got a windy uphill section with rocks on the side. So watch the trailer. Oh, we're close. Bro, this is ice road trucking for real. You can actually see where the snow is thicker a little bit. That would be one cool thing too, which, I mean, I know this is pro mods and they, can, they only have so much they can do um, because it is a mod. But I'm just thinking about, like, it'd be pretty cool if, like, these roads, after, like, it snows, the tracks were less defined. And whenever it gets that way, it also kind of makes the, the trail harder to drive through, you know what I mean? 
All right, wait. I think we made it to the to, to the summit of that. And now we're going downhill again. Uh, Captain Harrison, uh, I am still an Infinite Flight fan. Um, this is, f I think, oh, we have a truck coming the other direction? I know a lot of people think that I'm not because I haven't been streaming it in a while, but there's no, like, oh, okay, we got, uh-oh. We got a truck in it, so we got to pull over. <laughs> this is crazy. This is crazy. Yeah, I think it's be enough. Is he stuck? You got it, buddy. Parking brake on. He is. I think he's stuck. Look at him. Look at him bouncing around. How do I type? Is it Y? Hold on. Dang it, Starla! You got freaking notifications popping up on the screen. He said he's okay in, in the chat. It is, Andrew. This is so fun. <laughs> this is so freaking fun. I'm probably going to exclusively drive. I'm just kidding. I'm not exclusively driving anywhere. Uh, this is fun. I don't know what he's doing or why he's... He's he's hauling a train, it looks like. And that's heavy. That's one of the, the special cargo. <laughs> might take a while. <laughs> I know, right? And it happened. I jinxed it, didn't I, Andrew? I said earlier, what would happen if somebody was coming the other direction? Now we know. This is what would happen. Well, Graham, I don't know where you are, buddy. Um, but you got time to catch up. What do you say? Okay, cool. Oh, I see. Yeah, just park on the side because we got somebody... I, I'm pretty sure he's stuck. He said he's okay, but I'm pretty sure he's stuck. Listen to him revving. Like, that would be exciting to do if you had a shifter with a clutch and everything. That'd be so hard. Very nice. Good job, buddy. That's a professional right there coming through. All right, let's go. Before anybody else comes through the tunnel. Park and brake released. And it's a downhill for us, so it shouldn't be as difficult. But there is like a little curve in there. You gotta make sure you fit. I'm pretty sure he scraped the side of this thing. Yeah, that's one heavy boy for sure. We have like just a few, probably a foot of clearance on each side. Alright, now we're going back uphill. Yeah, this is the reason I wanted to go through the middle <laughs> and not the, the outside. Because the outside, you're going to get on the roads, on the highways. That's easy. This right here is fun. There's Raven down there. Like in 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 real in uh reality, they could charge a lot of money for this just for Iceland, <laughs> but it's free because the mod community is amazing. What up, Reynolds? Good to see you, man. The captain's here. Thanks for stopping by, my man. I really do appreciate that, bro. Hope you're having a great day. Yeah, this is a look at that ice. I wonder if we can drive out there. Oh, let's pay attention. Oh, the turning. This is not so hot. <laughs> Alright, uphill again. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Martin made the same wheel? Yeah, man, I like this wheel. I actually do. Um, not until recently have I actually thought about even upgrading, but only because I was having some issues with my wheel this weekend where my uh, force feedback wasn't working out of nowhere, which was really weird. I thought it was really weird. Um, but I would like to get some new pedals because my pedals do not currently have a clutch. So I would like to get a clutch and I would like to get a shifter. That's what I would like, but it's really not high on my priority list. So I don't know if or when if I'll ever get it. Um, but it is something that I would like to have uh, if I were to get anything. Yeah, I've had this wheel for probably about the same amount of time, Martin. Like, I don't know. How long has it been? How long have I been streaming iRacing? <laughs> Probably three, at least three years I've had this wheel. At least three. The pedals are okay. They're not amazing, but they're better than no pedals. So, I mean, I, these are the only pedals I've ever had, so I can't really compare it to anything. Like, if I've, if I've tried more things, I may be like, yeah, these pedals are like crap compared to something else, but. And I know they're, they're cheaper, so I don't expect them to be the best quality. But they do the job, and I feel like, matter of fact, I, I did two races last night, and I got second. Twice in a row to the same guy. I was so upset, but at the same time I was happy because I <laughs> finished in second. And it was a road course, um, so that was pretty exciting. Because I've never finished that high at a road course, like ever. So that's, that means that my road course game is getting a lot better. As far as my skill there, but um, but I did last week. I won two. Look at that big old snow patch. Jeez. Uh, last week I won two races. That's actually the the most wins I've ever gotten in one week. Uh, it was in the uh, the Oval D class series at Dover. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, I love, uh, I play, I have a set, so I haven't really spent a lot of time in it. Um, mainly because I've been more focused on racing, on iRacing. Um, I've spent a lot of time on F1 as well. El Bat Pino, welcome back, my man. Always bringing the cheese and the wine. Thank you very much, bro. I hope you're having a great day out there in France. Oh, yeah, I pretty much strictly play iRacing in VR. I, I don't remember the last time I played iRacing without VR. Um, I do play Acceptor Corsa as well in VR, and uh, I wish I wish so much that Formula One was in VR because that would be so freaking dope. Uh, but it's not. So uh, when I play a Formula One, I gotta play with just my regular screen. Confinement, man. You guys still in lockdown everywhere? I know we are. Well, we're not really in lockdown. It's like a soft quarantine. <laughs> Like a very lenient quarantine out here. Uh, me and my wife went out Friday or Saturday. I think it was Saturday. We just went out to get some uh, some smoothies, and uh, it was so many cars out on the road. Like I was like, what quarantine? <laughs> like I feel like I don't, it doesn't. It, it feel everything feels normal at least here where I stay at. Um, there are cases and stuff like that out there out here. There's apparently the U.S. I saw on the news we got more deaths now in our country than Italy, which was like the highest before. Um, but at the same time, when I leave the house and I drive on the weekend, which was Saturday, I think it was, um, just to get like a little uh, a smoothie, like the roads, like there was still traffic everywhere, like always out here. It was just weird. I was like, well, I thought everybody was staying home. Apparently everybody's not. They're yeah, driving around. Um, but I kind of came to the conclusion that most likely a lot of people are really going to visit close friends and family. Um, so I know that whenever I was driving to, that's what we were doing. Uh, we went over to my parents' house on Easter. Oh! <laughs> Rip that sign. Um, but yeah, we went to. Uh, uh oh, hold on. What's the sign say? No trucks? Actually, I don't know what that means. He said. Raven has said no trucks, apparently. Oh well. This is a very high priority cargo. But a lot of people are, are, are out uh, visiting family and stuff like that. So. Uh, which is kind of funny because at the same time even though we're staying home and we're you know promoting you know safe together whatever um, I think that the whole coronavirus and the quarantine is actually bringing people together in a way too because it, whenever you have to stay at home for so long eventually you want some human interaction and 
a lot of people are going out and spending time with family and stuff like that. So I've, I, honestly, yeah, I've spent more time with my family during the quarantine than I have before. Um, so that kind of just, just with my own, I guess, myself has kind of been that way. Oh God. <laughs> That's no, this is fun. This is fun. Should have this sooner. This is like way more fun than, than the Middle East. How you doing back there, Raven? You surviving? Not Raven, sorry, Graham. I know Raven's surviving, I see him. How you doing, Graham? How you doing? Yeah, I'm good. Cool, cool, cool. Uh oh, lost my momentum. Oh no. Yeah, I installed that, that new, was it the transmission or engine or something to help me uh, go through sections like this pretty good. What truck are you driving, Graham? Uh, the Scania. Scania, how's it doing? Pretty easy? Um, pretty easy. Not really. Uh oh. I, I got like to five mile an hour once and I thought I was going to be trapped, but I managed to get the job. I see. All right, looks like we do have some trucks coming the other way. I think Raven actually just stopped for them. We'll see. I do know that uh, this is only a one-way street. Oh, there's a traffic jam. What happened? What's the button for hazards? Should be at. Is it F? Yeah. Okay, I don't need it right now because I'm not stopping. I think this guy must have got stuck on the hill. Yo, this is real out here, man. Oh, he's rolling backwards. Yep, it's real out here, guys. Oh, man. Hey, watch out, bro. Iceland is claiming these trucks. my chat oh no are you freaking serious oh no it crashed <laughs> why oh that's so upsetting i was trying to tap over to see the chat and it crashed on me that's so lame we were at like the best part bro okay well open it again that really sucks i know right guys oh no I'm turning the music up then, because you know what happens whenever it crashes. We gotta hit that blue arrow radio. Hey, hey. Okay. Yep, IFMG, here we go. We haven't even made our first delivery yet. Oh, this beat is nasty. Uh. So it should uh, put us back on the mountain. I don't know where or how far back we'll be, but we should be at an auto save point not too far from where we were. Thankfully, it's not X-Plane. And it loads a lot faster than X-Plane too. Drink of water. Oh, we're not far at all. That was fast. Wow, ProMines, what up? Okay, here we go. Is there some kind of differential thing you can drive? Right, let me turn the music down, hold on. Back down to how it was. Now that we're back in game. All right, we're not too far back. I see, I think that's Graham. Yeah, it's Graham right up ahead of us. Look at that. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Trying to look out the window, I'm hitting stuff. I don't know if you guys saw, like it's like a little like sheet of ice and then underneath it is, yeah, anyways, it's cool. Yeah, even the navigation said, here we go. Not today, Big Monk, it's not today. All right, Graham, uh, I'm just gonna go around you. I think you're struggling just as much as I am on uh, going up the mountain. <laughs> if 
but I think it might be a little bit faster. It's a little bit. Driving a mountain like this sucks too at night. I mean, it's not super late, but it's late enough. I wonder if I need to change the time I stream Euro Truck Simulator so that we can drive in the daytime. Because every time we play ETS and stream at my streaming time, it's like consistently around the same time period. Like the same time of day. Wow, look at that bigger. What is he pulling? What is that thing? Hola, amigo. That looks heavy. You can't hear anybody but me? That's because nobody else is talking. <laughs> hey, Graham, just say something real quick, make sure they can hear you. Um, hi. Yeah, there you go. Eagle, so Holly, what's up, man? Good vibes, absolutely, bro. Always, always. We do out here in Blue Games. Alright, I think this is where we were before. Uh, I guess that truck that was like stuck is uh, now on the move. Oh god, come on, you got it. You got it. Let's go. It makes me want to drive with a clutch so bad. I would probably do horrible. It would either make me be horrible at it or maybe better. I'm not sure. Kind of like cooking simulator. <laughs> Man, look at this thing bouncing around. Oh no! We're stuck. Okay, we're not stuck. We got it. Let's see. Let's see. Uh oh. Come on. Come on. There it is! There it is, let's go! Fifth gear. Yeah, we got it. We got it! Raven, how do you have no fuel? I thought you guys said we could make it all the way. Oh, sorry! <laughs> okay, well... They don't need those. I think we all know we're turning right. This has been eventful. Bro, this truck is going, man. You gotta have a strong machine to attack this mountain. G29, what is up? He's got two dozers back there. Oh man, he has a double? How the heck? Alright, Fungi says, what is this stream? Alright, now we're on the skiing course? These are like the ski markers. Alright, I'm gonna leave it in 11th for now. We may go back down. Man, it is, this is so bouncy. Look at that. You can see like the, um, the snow like being pushed off the mountain by the wind. That's cool. That's a nice effect right there. Nice detail. Hey, right, so Raven, did you have to tow or what happened? Uh, you say you ran out of fuel. Not really sure how you ran out of fuel. Such a cool road. Such a cool road. Yeah, that's that too. Climbing mountains like this will definitely push and take a lot of fuel. I have a pretty large tank. My engine's pretty good on fuel, so not too much an issue for us. We should be able to make it, no problem. And this is crazy. This is our first leg. Like, I don't know if we're going to make it to the second leg. This is like a, I think it was like a, how long was it? 300 kilometers or? No. Yeah, it was six. I think it was 600. I think we are like halfway. Wow, look at that. That is cool. I want to take a screenshot. <laughs> I had to do it now. I 
can't really see like the dust all that good, but I guess this will have to do. That's one. Yeah, that snow and wind effect is really dope. I was not expecting to see that. I wish I could see the sun just a little bit higher, but you know, we gotta work what we got, I guess. Not really finding the angle I want too much. Get a foul in the snow. So that's okay. That's okay. Let's see, I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna, I think it might be in the way. All right, capture, let's go. All right, park brake released, let's roll. All right, I stopped, so I'll be back down the gears. All right, it should be downhill from here, I think. And look at the map, it's pretty windy still. Got a pretty big, it might be a convoy or something up ahead of us. A lot of stopped trucks. For why, I don't know. God, they got somebody overtaking. <laughs> Stop here. Put on the hazard. What was the hazard button? L? Oh, that's lights. Ah, that's lights. F? And they got trailer packs that I can't see. Oh, I ran over that cone. <laughs> I think it's all of them. Wow, what is he carrying? Jeez. How is he going to carry all that up there? Man, he's got this far. I guess he's okay. Park and brake release. Let's go. Alex, what's up, man? Good to see you up to the stream. Remember to get a Volvo truck. I might have to give that next time. My headlights are not on. Look at that, wow, oh, he's wide. Oh, we're gonna make it. My headlights are on, why are you saying that? Okay, they're fine, there we go. Turn your headlights on. All right, now we're on the dirt. Okay, what is it, L, F? Okay, there we go. Okay, the headlights are on for sure. Yeah, they're on. All right, yeah, I guess it's just, see a little, getting a little bit green out here. I don't know if you guys can hear it. We should unlock differential during regular driving or risk of damage. I ain't differentials off. This is cool. Alright, I think we may be home free. How, well, how's it looking up there, Raven? Is it better? Or are you uh, over there out of fuel? Can I give you fuel? Is that possible? I think I have an extra tank in the back. And Graham, how are you doing back there? Did you make it to the top? To the top? No. You did not make it to the top. I don't. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I basically took over the whole road just now. Like, I, I, I gave them no choice but to get out of the way. Uh, Logan, I, I, I would like to do Fat Sim. I don't think I'm going to do it today or tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow. I might be able to do it like later tomorrow after the stream. Maybe. Maybe. It's a maybe. But I can't today for sure. Bro, this, this dirt road is so freaking bumpy. And I'm just pedal to the floor right now. Rave, you better freaking push it. I'm coming. Okay, now I gotta slow down. So we do have traffic. Oh, it's gonna be tight. Ah, oh, Braven, you killed all of my momentum. Literally every bit I had is gone. 
this is sketchy too. Look at this hill. Man, this must be a pretty popular location because I'm seeing a lot of trucks coming in both directions. Oh, how is this gonna work? Oh my god. Trailer damage? On what? Oh man. Oh man! This would be so friggin' scary in real life. Look how close we are to the edge. Uh, Filiano, if you skip that screen, I believe it should work. No problem. Uh, whenever you have pro mods and you come into the game, uh, I think I think it all happens the first time. Um, it like says like you don't have a bunch of mods or something like that. I can't remember exactly what it says, but it's kind of misleading. You're like, okay, does my mods not work? But as long as it actually pops up with the splash screen, pro mods, two point whatever. Um, it should be working, so you can just go ahead and skip that screen. It should go ahead and take you there. So if that was your problem, hopefully it was, uh, then it, it shouldn't be too hard to fix. Look at this view, guys. Wow. All right, I still want to do the second leg. Uh, we're definitely, what time is it? Jeez. Uh, how, wow, we've been going for an hour just on this trip, I think. Um, I definitely do the second leg though. We we'll have to make the second leg happen. This is a volcano. Oh, cool, Raven. There's like so many is possibilities for pictures. I do like the uh, the wheel gravel sound. Um, I don't think I could do a drift if I wanted to, Ace. Uh, I haven't tried the Cyrus Vision Jet sounds by FT Sim. I know he, I know that he released it. I'm not a huge Cyrus flyer. Um, I do have a Cyrus, but I don't really fly it very much. Uh, Raven, why'd you stop? Are you okay? You take a screenshot. What's going on? Enjoying the view? Because there's a view to be enjoyed. Look at that. Oh, you just took out a sign. Oh, so did I. <laughs> oh boy. But yeah, I haven't tried the FT Sim uh, Cyrus sound pack yet. All right, we gotta go wide for this guy up ahead. These two guys, three guys. Wow, a lot of trucks going up. My horn is not working. Cute cookies, all right. So where are these trains going to? Everybody's hauling trains. He is lagging like crazy. Can't skip the screen. Mm. Oh, I guess just make sure you have it installed correctly. Make sure you follow the directions on the, on the ProMods website, like to the T, because it's very specific on how you need to install it. So just make sure you uh, follow those directions. The only screen that I can think of that I had an issue with was that screen whenever you first load into ProMods, and it's like telling you, hey, all these mods are like either not there or something. And then uh, it says like, I can't remember what it says. It's like a, a button you click on like confirm or something. And then it takes you in here. And I think Raven is now doing this on purpose. What is that? Interesting. All right, don't hit it. Don't hit it. Don't hit it. Don't hit it, don't hit it. Alright, we didn't hit it. Uh oh, that's not good. Raven's backing up. I mean, if those guys with trains could make it through here, then I think we're okay. Our, our cargo is not that massive. But this is freaking cool. that right side. Oh. 
Oh, I hit some. Is this mud? Look at my tires and how they're sunk in. Alright, so we hit that rock right there. So I think that's the reason that Raven had to back up earlier. So we gotta... Oh, dang. You could've warned me, bro. <laughs> you could've warned him, brother. Alright, Graham. I'll see you, man. Thanks for driving or attempting to drive with us. Alright, we seem to go a little bit wider. This was definitely fun. I definitely recommend later on, Graham, when you do get a chance. Uh, try it again. Don't hit the rock. Don't hit the rock. I think we made it this time. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> we made it. And Raven, you took the sign out. Just that, or maybe, maybe one of the other guys took it out. Oh, we got it. Come on. It's a tight squeeze. We got it. Differential. <laughs> I like the differential. I never had a purpose for it. We got it. Man, that was fun. But um but yeah, that differential is extremely helpful. Lots of rocks on these roads. Uh, don't hit it. Alright, we missed it. Uh, Raven's having an issue with his microphone, and IFNG's not here because he doesn't have the DLC. And then Graham just left. He's not a talker. <laughs> so he just got me. He stuck with me today, guys. But it's been fun. I've been enjoying this. This drive. Like, I would not mind doing that, like, it's, like two or three more times. With various, diff like, various cargo. Like, that would be fun. And I don't know if you guys can hear my my wheel vibrating on this dirt road. Is the sun going up? It looks higher than it was. Yeah, hopefully we'll be able to do some uh, some driving next week. Uh, I'm actually like driving in uh, the Euro Truck Sim and, and American Truck Sim lately. Uh, I've been kind of more interested in like this kind of thing and. There's a new game coming out uh, next week, I believe, or maybe the week after, called SnowRunner, and it's getting more and more interesting to me because of what we just did. SnowRunner is basically that with uh, really good physics <laughs> and graphics. So it's like you basically drive a trailer up a mountain or whatever, and um, and you know make through the snow, all that kind of stuff. So it's like it's all the, all those challenges are there. And Raven, did you just jet on me? I don't even see you anymore. How much farther do we have? Let's see. We have... Hold on. 208 kilometers, 3 hours and 46 minutes. That's not real time. That's in-game time. So we should get there about 6 a.m. game time. We're carrying 15 tons. And we'll make about 37,000 off of this job if we get there safely. It is bouncy. Gonna apex this corner because there's nobody coming. But yeah, I'm, I'm getting more and more interested in that game. Uh, I talked about it last Tuesday when we drove uh, about me like somebody told me about it. But I think I'm pretty much sold on getting it um, mainly because of like this drive and how fun it was trying to get up a mountain with heavy cargo. Hopefully Raven has fuel. <laughs> he said he was out of fuel earlier. This is weird, like this is Iceland. Like this looks nothing like I would expect Iceland to look. It looks like a desert out here. What up Drewski man? Good to see you man. That's not the right button. Look at this, we're in the middle of freaking nowhere. I should try Coach Bus Simulator. That sounds a little bit out of out of uh, out of my range of interest. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I might. It might be interesting. I have no idea. I did mention last week that I was me doing different simulators. But if you so, if you do have suggestions of simulators you would like to see me try or play, uh, you can send those through Discord. Would be the best way to, for me to see them on my feedback channel. And I think Raven stopped back there just to show me how much faster he is. He just zoomed by me. I'm going basically as fast as I can. 
right now. And 14th gear is pretty much flat. The road smoothened out. I can only believe there's going to be probably going to be some more challenges for us at some point ahead. But this road has been very unpredictable for my first time on it. Really? So at first you didn't like it, but it grew on you. What What do you like about it? Or is that not the right not, not the right question to ask? <laughs> not sure. Threw that screen for a while. But I think honestly, Raven and everybody else who are listening, I think this is my favorite drive I've done ever on any truck simulator, and that's the truth. Um, I've done other drives that are pretty cool, pretty interesting. The Middle East stuff was pretty cool. I like that. Oh man, we're we're going now. Oh, we're going now. Look at that. Uh, but this is definitely my favorite that I've done so far. Huh, SCS was supposed to release Bose, Bus Coach Sim, but haven't heard anything. They might have canceled it, I don't know. They already got two games that they're making a lot of DLC for. I don't really see how they would have time to make a whole nother game unless they have like a bigger team than we think. Alright guys, we're hitting, uh, how fast are we going right now? 120 kilometers, oh my god, we're going. <laughs> Raven, you better watch out because I am not stopping. I gotta wait, oh wait, yeah I am, there's a stop coming up. Let's see, I, I got too much momentum. That's true, a lot of these driving games are kind of like a chill and play kind of game. Like this one, this is definitely a chill and play kind of game. I played last night, it was a little too chill for a midnight. So that was like midnight when I was playing. It's a little too chill for a midnight, play some sheep. Because I start Get falling asleep. Turn left. And matter of fact, I actually got in a... I fell asleep playing Euro Truck Simulator last night and I did crash. Turn left. Crashing, I crashed into a pole, I can't remember what I hit. But I crashed, like man, this is why I don't drive sleepy in real life. And if you do, it is scary. Anyway, I think we're almost there. No, no, we're not. We're an hour away. <laughs> Never mind. If you needed some gas, looks like they don't have any. Honestly, I think they should add, like, instead of. SCS making a bus simulator. Why don't they incorporate buses into American Truck Simulator? I think that would that would make that would be better. Anyway, Alex, man, thank you again, man, for the follow. Really appreciate that, bro. Welcome to the Blue Arrow Roy family. Man, it is busy on these streets. My horn is not working for some reason. Wow, so we started out in the snow. Freaking cold snow, now we're out here. Well, we passed through the what well, looked like a desert. Or you guys said it was a volcano, it might have been ash. Now we're on some beautiful prairies out here, some flat grasslands. But yeah, I think it'd be kind of cool to incorporate buses. I'm getting passed. Uh, into American Truck Sim and Euro Truck Sim later. At the roundabout. Oh, shoot. Take the second exit. Roundabout. That brakes are way too strong. <laughs> exit now. The roundabouts really throw me off. But yeah, just incorporate bus stops and stuff like that into the game. Uh, it would definitely be more interesting if you could get. Honestly, before all that stuff, I want freaking AI. On truckers and Pete. I know that's not a SCS thing, I don't think, <laughs> to make that work, but still, I want, I, I still, even though in Europe, Euro Truck Simulator is a lot more busy with multiplayer traffic than American Truck Simulator, I just want AI traffic on the streets out here. Like, I did a drive on single player and I enjoyed it so much because there's AI. Nice little dried up river. Look at that, look at that view. Man, that's beautiful. I mean, honestly, people could turn, like, America, like, kind of like how 5M turned GTA into, like, a roleplay thing. You could do kind of something similar 
with the world of ATS and Euro Truck Sim, if you just incorporate some different cars, um, you know, and incorporate some buses, incorporate more uh, regular cars, Get stuff like that. Turn right. All right, turning right. And Raven is dusted right, right now. Right. Yes, I am American. I am very American. Yeah, man, AI traffic. If it's laggy, make it unlaggy. <laughs> make it work. GTA made it work, sort of. Make it work. It's possible. GTA showed us that it's possible to have AI traffic on multiplayer. That's cool, Andrew. That's pretty cool. Oh, right. We gotta take a ferry, so we're almost there. Once we get on the ferry, we'll basically be there. Man, that was a trip, guys. That was a trip. Get ready to turn left. Like, I, I, we're gonna need a, a break after that one. I'm making a left up here. Turn left. I think it's the second one. What did I hit? Bro, swinging it wide. Rerouting. Finding the <sighs> route. That was a journey. I am stressed out. All right, only one place to go. There, embark. Okay, let's find a new route. That was truly a trip. <laughs> that was still my favorite trip I've made ever on on, on this game ever. Finding and includes American Truck Sim too. Like it was one. It was definitely worth the wait. Alright, basically we're going next door to drop this off. I don't know where we are, like this must be like some kind of small little like industrial island or something south of Iceland. Get ready to It's like right. just south of it, it's not even like far off. But you gotta take a ferry to get there. Turn right. Alright, don't turn red on me. Ed Venus, yesterday you did a five thousand. 428 kilometer trip. Jesus, bro. That is long. <laughs> How much kilometers did you drive today? I think today we only did like 700 for this first trip. Um, I think the next one is another 700. Right. Which is probably going to be equal to an hour in real life. I'm um, excited. I really want to do it. I think it's going to be just as interesting as this one was. Alright, here's our stop. Now we got to park. You have arrived at your destination. Hey, yo, man, what's up, my dude? Finished. I had a great Easter, man. Thanks for asking. Probably, honestly, one of my favorite oh, Easter's that I've had. <laughs> All right, we can park it there. We can park it there. We'll put it, put it there. It's still going straight in. Uh, I'll go around. Can I go that way? I would just go straight through. Bad, good. Um, what did I do on Easter? Oh yeah. Um. Woke up, basically hung out with my wife for a little while, and then uh, we headed to my parents' house, which is like right down the street. And then, where, where is it at? And then we uh, we went over there, grilled some, uh, what did we make? Steak? Ribs? Ribs. Grilled some ribs. Well, my dad, I can't take credit, because my dad made the ribs. <laughs> and then my wife made some baked potatoes on the grill, too. I didn't really cook anything. <laughs> But it was good. It was fun. I enjoyed it. It was really nice. Got to see my mom, too. Alright, now we gotta park. Here's the hard part. I gotta do my job. Turn the other mirror on. Let's see if we can get this in one 
and one push. Oh, we're a little far. Yep, there's a wall. Dang it, man! Uh, Logan, I actually don't use Spotify for streams. I, I wish I could because I I have playlists that I would be jamming to. Matter of fact, when I play offline, like off stream, Euro Truck or American Truck Simulator, like I jam the heck out of these road trips. <laughs> you know what I mean? But I mean, we're still jamming, sort of. Not as hard as I would be if I had my, my Spotify music, but it's all copyrighted. So, you know, I can't really use that for stream or I, I get demonetized. All right, that's close enough. Decouple. Can't beat the sound of a Euro engine. All right, all right, that took, uh, time taken six hours, fuel consumed 178, that's not too bad. Uh, let's see, we should have some jobs out of this city too. Hopefully it is here. Let's take a look at the job market and we'll get our second job up. And this will be our final job. First job took probably like four times longer than I expected. <laughs> All right, uh, we want to go here, actually. This is exactly my job. The gasoline, 21 tons of petrol. You guys would call it. Set that as a GPS Let's destination. We'll go pick up our second job. Park break released. Um, but uh, for the person who's asking about the music, I use uh, epidemicsound.com for my music. They have a lot of uh, songs that people can use for streaming and content creation. I've been using them for, I don't know, a little while now. Not a little while, probably a lot, a lot of while, like six, six months or so. Um, but it's not free, it is a paid subscription monthly. You can see why I don't like paying monthly for things. I got so many freaking monthly subscriptions. I got the music for I got the music subscription. I got the freaking Navigrad subscription. Pilot Air subscription. <laughs> All these subscriptions, man. I hate them. I do, I hate them. Oh, I think the pickup is here the same place I think that's it right there let's see freight market yeah there she is I'll take it Lincoln was shot today Lincoln who nice right behind us Like, I feel like this is not a good time to shoot people. Like, dang, like, we got a virus going on. Like, Let's let that go. take, let nature take course. And be patient. All right, I think we got it. All right, here we go. Let's go. All right, this job is, uh, I think, less heavy. The last one was how much? 30 something? Yeah, 31 ton. This one's a little bit, little, a little less. It's 21 tons of gasoline. Uh, this is a. Get ready to turn left. Let's see how long this is a 708 kilometer trip 11 hours just about equal to our last one um it depends on how windy the roads are or how long it's actually going to take because that last trip took us a quite a long time we were kind of going at a snail's pace through the snow uh, we will have the snow again though get ready to turn left Oh, Turn oh, left. you mean this is the anniversary of him getting shot. I'm like, <laughs> I thought you meant like he got like, like a guy named Lincoln got shot yesterday or, or today. I'm like, geez, like, why? Stop shooting people, guys. This is not Call of Duty. All right, back on the ferry we go. I think he should disappear. There you go. Okay, let's find a new group. I also want to change the voice uh, of my GPS. I'm gonna change it to like a, a lady. I, I rather a female GPS voice. That's what I prefer. Hold on, my wife is texting me. Let's really quickly change that. 
I've been wanting to do that for a while anyways. I think it's under audio. <sighs> right now we got UK Doug. Let's do... I remember using that old granny that one time. That was pretty hilarious. Sky? We could use Sky. I don't want to use Sky, though. Michelle in French. I would just use Sky. She's US. It's okay. Let's test her. Review. Finding a new route. Alright, let's close that. Alright, so my wife is on the way home. She needs to take a quick pit stop. <laughs> but she'll be back out. <laughs> so I might have to, like... Hit the stream on pause. How long have we been going? Have we been going that long already? She's already about to come back home. Yeah, wow, almost two hours and we're only on our s <laughs> the beginning of our second leg. Jeez. If I only had a dollar for every time somebody asked about infinite flight, bro, I'd be the richest streamer. I'm just kidding, no, I wouldn't be. But I do need to unlock the door for her. So hold on. I'm gonna park here, Raven, behind you. I'm not ready to go yet. Get ready to turn right. And there we go. Uh, parking brake. I'm also gonna turn the camera off so she doesn't walk. I know you guys want to see my wife, but I want you to see. My, she doesn't want to be seen. <laughs> so hold on. All right, I am back for now. So let's head out. Once she gets home, I'll probably pull over for a second and then we'll have to continue once she, uh, I'm done with her. Usually I try to be done by before now, but turn right. I really want to do this leg. All right, I'm making a right turn here. It just shouldn't be too hard as far as the oh nice the sun's coming up I love it. I think what time is it now? I'm, I'm gonna, I think I might start my ETS streams at this time <laughs> when the sun's coming up, not when it's going down. When I usually start it two hours earlier. Uh, Drewski, yes, I am running at max graphics. I just saw your comment. Oh, uh, you're a truck somewhere? Look at that sunrise, that's nice. Get ready to turn left. Yep, I remember now why I turned her voice off. Not a fan of Sky. Turn left. She's all right. We do have to be careful though with this uh, with this cargo because we are carrying gasoline. It's highly explosive. Thank you, Jen. Or Yen. Uh, my report. Am I excited for the triple seven? Uh, it's an infinite flight. Uh, well, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Not like super excited, but I'm looking forward to it. I think it's gonna be a great addition, as well as the clouds. I think I'm more interested in the clouds than the Triple Seven itself. But I think one thing that does pique my interest about it is the sounds. 
Um, before I heard about the sounds, I was not really interested very much. I was like, oh, this is pretty cool. It's going to look good. Um, but I think the biggest thing I wanted personally was to hear the triple sound, the triple seven sound like a triple seven in a in a jet and not just having it, a generic vacuum sound to it. Steven, what's up, man? Good to see you. Welcome to the stream. Let's turn the beacons off because they're not really heavy anymore. We're not really a wide load or anything. Yeah, I feel you, man. Uh, it's, it sucks having little friends in those big cities. Beautiful out here, though. The countryside. Straight on. Bro, we, we moving now. We moving now. I love all the livestock and cattle and stuff like that. Ooh, watch out. This is what I meant though by like how like some of Iceland is like green and some of it is like actual ice. Now we're seeing the green part of Iceland. Cell phone scissors discovered. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Exit now. Go straight on. At the roundabout, take the first exit. Oh, he took that sign out. Exit now. All right, back to some windy roads. 